morning my loves and welcome to my 6am morning routine. Having a morning routine is truly so special to me as it really sets me up to have a positive productive day and I love this routine especially as it adds a little coziness to every single day. So after my alarm goes off at 6am it has been a struggle to get back into the swing of getting up early but I am very very grateful for Jamie as he fully motivates me and also loves getting up early. He always pops downstairs first to feed the cats and he brings me a lovely warm extremely strong coffee in bed. Whilst I'm enjoying my first morning coffee, I always write down three things I am grateful for. This is by far my favourite part of my morning. It's something that you can add to your day straight away and it will make such a huge positive difference to your life. When you take the time to focus on the good things in your life, you naturally become more of a positive and happy person. Next, I'm going to take a lovely warm shower to help wake me up. I'm usually more of an evening shower or bath person, but I really do find taking a shower in the morning makes me feel so fresh and much more motivated for the day ahead. I'm using my Soap and Glory shower gel which I just love the smell of and it also brings back all of my teenage memories and I'm also using the Frank Body coffee scrub. This is perfect for the mornings as of course it's coffee scented and I feel like it helps wake me up even more but it also leaves my skin feeling so soft and hydrated which is perfect for these colder months. <laughs> Once I'm out the shower and I've got my big cozy dressing gown on, I'm going to brush my teeth and also do my morning skincare routine. Today is a no makeup day like most of my working from home days are, so I'm going to give my skin a little bit of extra care as it's been feeling so dry lately as it's so cold outside. I'll link all of the products that I'm using down below as they are perfect for the chilly weather. Then it's time to pop on some cozy cloves, which I love to keep on the radiator, so they are super toasty when I pop them on. I 
time for another favorite part of my morning which is my second coffee which I look forward to every single day I recently bought a Nespresso machine and it was the best investment in my entire life I love it so much my favorite coffee recipe consists of I like to use a vanilla eclair Nespresso pod so yummy then I use some oat milk and a dash of iced cinnamon bun syrup best coffee ever And then I also pour myself a homemade mug of lemon and ginger tonic. I will leave the recipe down below, but I have this every single morning topped up with hot water. It really helps my digestion, it stops me feeling bloated, and it generally just makes me feel a lot healthier. When lights go out You're in my mind So over the past few months, I've really fallen out of a routine of having breakfast. I've never really been much of a breakfast person, so that's something I'm definitely working on and trying to add to my morning routine. So this morning, I'm going to make myself a lovely, refreshing smoothie bowl. I'm using frozen banana and strawberries with a dash of coconut milk and then with lots of yummy toppings such as cashews, flaked almonds, desiccated coconut, this is a perfect, light, refreshing, but also filling breakfast. Whilst I enjoy my breakfast cosy on the sofa, I'm going to read a few pages from my quote book. This book is called Everything You'll Ever Need by Charlotte Freeman. By reading a few of these every morning, it just, it helps me feel more positive and I feel like it's so important to take just 10 minutes out in the morning, even if it means getting up 10 minutes earlier, just to take a little bit of time to do something that makes you feel good. I feel like that's really important. I'm going to take my lemon ginger tonic to my office where I will review my to-do list for the day. I always have a to-do list every single day which I usually make at the weekend or I make the night before so I feel ready for the day and I know exactly what's going on. Then 
thank you so much for spending this lovely little morning with me. I know how hard it can be to get back into a routine, but this is your reminder that you'll feel so good once you've found a routine that you really enjoy and it suits your lifestyle. And it's important to bring yourself a little bit of happiness every single day. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.